hey beautiful people welcome back to my channel if you're new welcome don't forget to subscribe abone who who play turn on your notification bell so that you don't miss my next videos and i really appreciate if you engaged in the comments just comment as many times as you can and also like this video so that youtube can spread it to more people in this video i'm going to be trying out algerian snacks and i'll be rating them from one to ten so i have two parts this video is the first part where i'm going to be reviewing snacks like biscuits chips i don't know these are puffs and i don't know what category this is then the second part is going to be about candy and drinks or just beverages in general so i hope you guys enjoy the first one is this this is potato chips by Mabu, I don't know if that's how you pronounce it. I like this. Okay, this I've tested this before. I usually get this one and I'll give it a 9.8. Next up is Burgers. These are really popular here and I've tested other flavors and I'm going to test this one for the first time. I can test the flavor, like the sour cream flavor, but it's trying. I don't know. I'm in between. I can give it a an eight. Shuri in natural cheese test flavor. There's something about the cheese. I don't know it has some aftertaste so i don't really like this <laughs> i'll give them a 6.5 next we have cocoa and one thing that's shocking me about this is they are peanut flavored i've never tested peanut flavored puffs like in my life my friend usually tells me on our jerry two table sip so i'm not really surprised i'm not shocked because anything is possible here mm. Woo. guys the first thing i smelled was the peanuts like it's just like i'm having groundnuts wow I don't know it's like i'm having peanut butter that's crunchy mm. it's a no for me for the effort i'll give it a two and there's this it's noodles chips noodles and it says noodles test i really like this they are so nice i'll give them for this i'll give them a 10 to be quite frank a 10. up next we have batata batata is batata means potatoes in arabic if i'm not mistaken but yeah we have batata barbecue test so this is batata yeah so this is it I don't know if these are supposed to be like crisps or what but i don't like them like they i don't know i don't know how i can describe this but they are really thick and they are in between puffs and crisps so i don't really get like choose a side i'll give it a six fritos fritos also hot barbecue test so i'm expecting this to be hot ah, 
it's actually like fries i guess that's why it's fritos i like it and it's hot but not like super hot but oh okay i can taste the chili now <laughs> but yeah it's okay i'll give it 8.5 crunchy crunchy sour cream and onion Yo. oh this is air and do I don't know why people do this. All this is air, like for what? Watch out. I like this. It has this Simba vibe, like Simba crisps vibe. I like it. I'll give this one. A 10 so we have the sweet things here and i'm going to start with this this is maxo and it's like oreo i've never tried this one i've never tried this actually give this a nine because it actually tastes like oreo though like oreo light <laughs> so i'll give it a nine then we have this which is magdalena's in flavor phrase which is strawberry i've had the chocolate one before so i decided to go with something i haven't bought before the chocolate one was quite good like a cupcake and it has some sort of like jam jelly yeah it's nice though the strawberry part in the middle is too sweet for me but I really like it like I like the consistency and I'll give it a 9.5 next we have tango tango by bimo i've noticed bimo makes a lot of things like biscuits so i'm just gonna test it this is nice and i think it would go well with some tea i'll give it 9.8 i really like it maybe because i love chocolate but it's really good Mongute and it says Fure Ogu Chocolat. I love chocolate, so this will be interesting. It looks like some sort of cake, and I've never tested this. So. Let's see. Oh, <laughs> it actually has this inside, and it says there are 10 of them. I'm curious to know how it is like. Okay. This is literally like cake with chocolate cream. So I'll give this one a nine point. No, I'll give this one a ten. It's actually nice. I'll give it a ten. And there's this. I usually buy this as well when I'm studying. I usually take this. It's cool. This is how it looks like. There's chocolate in between. It actually tastes like hazelnut. For me, this is a 10. 10 out of 10. I like this. We have this. It's called Brasito Fure a la Truth. So, I don't know why it looks so sweet even before I, before I test it. Okay. This is it. Mm. 
it's nice but it's too chocolatey for me like it's too much chocolate in here because there's chocolate down there's chocolate on top and then there's also chocolate inside so for me because of the too much chocolate i'll give it 8.8 reno so let me open up Reno. this thing this thing wants to embarrass me So is it that the, this is wrong advertising or what because on the packet on the packet as you can see there's like some chocolate at the center but it's different there's nothing like that so anyway for wrong advertising i'll give it i'll remove it too but yeah so it's not as it's Written on the cover, so I'll give this eight, yeah, because they lied about the chocolate and the middle, so and then it's it's not bad, so I'll just give it eight. So these are the last things I'm going to be reviewing, and these are sunflower seeds and nuts. So the first one is this. So this is Dorista and these are sunflower seeds. I've never had sunflower seeds in my life like ever. So this is going to be interesting. I always used to look at these and I'm like, don't buy that. Don't buy that. Like I didn't even know they're sunflower seeds. I don't know, they've got some weird smell. And my friend told me that these ones are black, then this, these ones are white. And I was taught to remove the the, the cover and I don't know funny thing is the cover looks like it's salty because I can see the salt grains so I don't know how this tastes hmm it's not really tasty but the cover is salty, so I don't get the point. So I'll just test one more time so that I can really get the taste. Like, how do people eat these? Like, there are so many inside, and you're supposed to break them like every time. So I don't know if you can see, but this is how tiny it is. Like this. Yeah. And now I really don't like it that much. I'll just give it a five. I really can't get the flavor. Like I'm trying to get like where is the taste? So for me I'll give them a five. This is what? This is Chihuahua grain the tuna so yeah sunflower sunflower grains for seeds mm -mm. it's not something i would go to a shop and buy i'll give this one a four nah lastly we have this it's hot eggs and it's written cacahuetes on robe good pizza so this is quite quite fascinating because it's pizza flavored nuts <laughs> i've never had that i don't know what they're trying to do my brain is confused is it pizza is it ground nuts like i've never seen like it's coated i don't know let me try to break it so i just wanted to show like so there's a huge coating like there's a huge coating around and that i don't know what they used to coat but that's the pizza flavor so it's like pizza is coating the nuts then then when i remove the shell or the coating this is the nut so it just confuses you it's like the first few seconds you're enjoying the pizza flavor 
then the last second is like you've gone to a different world so this is it i hope you enjoyed this video don't forget to like don't forget to comment don't forget to subscribe to turn on the notification bell i'll see you in my next video where i'm going to review candy and beverages bye